Lewis Hamilton just took his 92nd win um, and is now the most successful Formula One driver of all times, having won the Portuguese Grand Prix. I'm just going to tell you my thoughts about it. Well, we had quite an eventful start, didn't we? I mean, um, Carlos Sainz had a brilliant getaway and was leading the race for three for three laps um, because um, Hamilton lost. Hamilton got overtaken by um, by three bars, um, and there was a massive coming together between uh, Perez and Verstappen. Verstappen ended the, the, the race in third position, um, and and Perez ended up being in ended the race in sixth position, position having having um been been in fifth position for much of the race, um. You know, I was I was surprised that he was able to continue after that coming coming together. But uh, six, sixth place is still is is still um, actually quite all right. So I was I was um, really surprised. But what I wasn't surprised about. What I was, what, what I am a bit angry about is the fact that, um, that Alex Alban is is so so slow and nearly got left by his teammate Max Verstappen. And um, if I was him and Marco, I would fire Alex Alban straight away and um, sign a contract with Hülkenberg tonight because there, there's no there's no way that they can keep uh, Alex Alban um, in that seat any longer. I mean, this is not because I'm a, I'm a Hülkenberg fan, but this, this performance for Alex was a shambles, um, and if if um, Red Bull don't react now, I mean, I, I, I'm very, gonna be very angry, and um, you know, I'm I'm gonna be very angry and very disappointed because back in when back in Russia, um, 2000, um. Back in Russia, 2016, I think it was when um, when um, Kvyat um, drove into Sebastian Vettel, um, Kvyat lost that seat um, to Max Verstappen straight away. But I, but for some reason, with Alex Alban, they they um the the uh, Red Bull is waiting such a long time, and um, if they if they don't replace him with Hülkenberg after for the next race, I'll be very surprised um because he is not good enough. For Formula One, um, yeah, that's just what I'm thinking. Um, what do you guys think about it? Let me know in the comments below. Um, and as I said, I think I think the um, championship is is done and dusted. As I said, huge congratulations to um, to Lewis Hamilton. 
for scoring his 92nd Grand Prix victory. I said it before and I say it again. I mean, I'm massively um, disappointed that uh, that um, Schumacher is gonna ha has now lost that um, that um, record and is is probably gonna lose the the uh, number of world championships. Um, I think I think um, Lewis Hamilton is gonna get at least eight, if not ten. Um, depending how long he's going to stay in Formula One. But, uh, you know, um, whether you like him or whether you hate him, you, you, you can't, you have to acknowledge what he's done, what he's achieved. And, um, you know, I think we have, we have to treasure um, Lewis Hamilton while while he's still in the sport, because I don't know how long he's going to be in the sport for. Um, but uh, huge respect. Um, over overall, I think it was a good race. Um, I mean, I can't understand. I can't understand um, why Lance Lance Stroll ha had them. Um, had like five, five, five times he um, didn't obey the the uh, track limits, but then a lot of other drivers got got a couple, got a few warnings. But uh, you know, I think uh, it, it was a good race, and uh, no doubt the rain spiced it up a bit more. And uh, as I said, um, I expect. Um, Nico Eikenberg to be in um, the Red Bull seat by um, Imola uh, next next weekend uh, because I think um, Alex Ivan's time is is uh, up now. So, what do you guys think? Let me know in the comments below. Cheers for watching. If you haven't already, do feel free to like, comment and subscribe. And um, I'll speak to you soon, guys. Bye for now. Bye.